Alrighty guys, this is going to be the Cassidy unranked to GM. And now of course with Cassidy, the better your aim is, the better you're going to be, the easier it'll be to rank up. But I'm going to show you how with your positioning alone and your ability usage, how you can rank up without that. This one's going to be just the placements. We're trying out something new. Let me know if you guys like the video split up like this. Let's go ahead and hop right into it though. And a quick little tip before we start guys, you can actually roll out of a lot of things just like a Diva Bomb. Tracer's Pulse Bomb. Even things like Echo Stickers will do a lot less damage when they explode on you if you roll. Alrighty, this is going to be the Cassidy Unranked GM. As you all can see, only played Quick Play on this account. Let's go ahead and just hop right into it. So on this map, guys, we really want to be playing around the main point. But if we notice there's a open flank on the left or the right side there, we're going to want to be taking that flank to open up a crossfire on these guys. So like I was saying, we want to be taking this top left high ground right here. Why do we want to be taking that? Because it's going to open up an off angle for us. And so you guys may be asking yourself, why do we take this off angle right here? Well, let's imagine that our team is pushing down main as what typically happens. And their team is pushing main and they're all grouped up right about here. Well, what happens is when we take this off angle, we get an extra angle to shoot at them. So we're going to have an easier point of view on their back line to get easier shots off while our team is pushing down main. And then also on the plus side for us is they're going to be getting shot from the front and from the side. So their supports and their back line isn't going to know what to do. They're going to be struggling. They'll be like, oh crap, there's a Cassidy on our flank. What do we do? What do we do? So the only thing this team can do is they either have to push forward and fight our team here. Or they're going to have to retreat back and get behind cover because we're taking this off angle. But to start it out. I'm gonna go main down with our team. Don't want to get caught out early. We're just gonna play a little slow. We see where, see where things go. We saw Sombra over top right. It'll be something we want to be aware of. We hear Widow, so we're gonna go take a flank over on the left side, and they have a hog. So really, we just need to stay away from the hog and try to play in the range where we can kill this Widow. This hog's rotating on our left here. Now he's going back down main, so we can peek out left side again. Try and hit Sombra with that nade, so we can catch her out. And now we can go back to looking for this Widow and the rest of them. Widow scoped in on us, so now we gotta be careful. And we just gotta pay attention to this Hog's Hook. Gonna play near cover. Always want to make sure we're playing tied to cover, especially against someone like a hog. So if he peeks out, we immediately want to peek back behind cover so that we don't get hooked. And just as they're pushing in on this hog, we're pushing back. They're no longer on Widow, but they still are on Sombra. Sombra's on our Doom, so we can push up a bit. I'm just going to keep playing here. Seems like hog's far right, so we can chill out a bit. We can try and go finish off the Zenyatta. Looks like he may have gotten out. All good. And try and bring Hog's attention over here. We can roll back out. Now we're out. Hog's going left side, so we're going to kite back down main. We don't want to kite back left because it'll give Hog a chance to hook us. Use his hook so we can look a little bit forward there for a second. He's going to have his hook back up now, so we got to chill. Pretty sure he just used it on our Doom so that we can chill out again. Really, we're just trying to stay away from this hog. Probably not going to be able to. Unfortunate. Looks like hog's not chasing us anymore, so we're going to go back down left side. And just regroup with our team here. Hog's gonna have that hook back up. We gotta be careful for it. Now we're just gonna keep taking another off angle with our team. And there we go. That should be the round for us.
And for point two, we're gonna to wanna to do the same exact thing. We're gonna take the top left at high ground right here. We do that because whoever controls top left is going to control the fight. And if they push us top left, we push back out and regroup with our team. If you guys are liking the content so far, consider dropping a like and a sub, and come check me out live on Twitch. I stream every Monday through Thursday, waiting for them to 4 p.m. to cheating. midnight CST time. Yeah. Yo, quiet. Thanks for the follow, homie. And so here we're gonna start off main, but if they don't take this top left side, we're gonna go take it from them. We're gonna save our roll so that we can always roll back towards our team here. But this left side allows us to create an off angle, really pinch the team. We're getting pushed a little hard here, so we're gonna push back out. We don't wanna stay there too long, get caught out by their Genji and their Zarya. So we're gonna go take down main now. Uh, unfortunate. That Sombra's out, we're just gonna let her go. I'm not gonna chase that. So we get, if we chase that, a 1v1 with a Sombra when she's invis, she can start off that virus, or she can hit us with that virus started off. That's a disadvantage fight for us. We don't. We always want to take uneven duels for the other team. If that makes sense. We don't want to ego duel anyone. That's how you lose fights. Even if you are better, better mechanically than the other person, you're just not smart. And there, I didn't throw my nade because it would have been way too far for me to actually land that nade before she could react to it. So it would have just been a wasted nade. We saw this Genji dash. We can try and look for a nade now. That's two of Zarya's bubbles. She's only going to have one more coming up. And then we just roll back to the team. Now we're just playing with our team, putting out damage, shooting pretty much whoever we see. Of course, looking for squishy and supports first, if possible. But if not, there's no problem with shooting the SIG. That sure is a lot of ultimates. And so still, we're not going to overextend. We're just going to play this. They're, they're going to be forced to touch. Their more is going to have to dash into maybe touch, but she still shouldn't have touch. But if we go out feed, that gives them a chance to win the fight. And they didn't have one prior. Damn, that's my bad there. It's Q o'clock. <laughs> Flam Bam, you ask, what's the best way to improve aim, like aim training or just playing the character a lot? Aim training, of course, is the best way to just improve your aim like your raw aim especially using kovacs finding a good uh good course i like to use voltaics um but outside of that playing the character a lot still going to train your aim and improve your aim that's what i was doing a more uh bronze all righty on dorado main thing here is we're gonna go we're pretty much going to play, uh, play around the payload for the first point. Try and see if we can get a pick. If not, we're going to go around this big right flank on the side. And then try and get something off the top. Unless they have something like a hog that will punish us for that. So right now we're just chilling, waiting to see. Putting out some damage. Seeing if we can't get a, maybe a headshot. Pick somebody off. Well, that's unfortunate. Now we're going to walk over to the right side here because look, we're still pushing cart. We're right around, we're right around uh, cover. And then we can just back off for a second. We end up getting a pick two, which is good for us. It'll help us push in. And look, we're getting so much cart progress right now. We're just chilling. We don't want to go up too far because now we can. We're going to wait for this Bastion Sur to go down. We can peek out a little farther. I'm playing this right room real quick. Ryan's already pushing in hard, so we're going to just kite back. Oh, we took too much damage there. Oh, 
All right, you're gonna save my roll in case we take a headshot from Ash or something. We're gonna try and go take this top left high ground here. Why are we gonna do this? So when my team's walking down main, it'll open up an off angle for us to get a kill potentially. There we go. Make sure that this brig isn't pushing us here. And we can just keep staying on this off angle, just chilling. We're gonna look for this brig. She's the most out of position. And we're just gonna walk on this left side here. Just looking for a flank currently. Hopefully this Ryan doesn't come to pin us. Looks like we're fine. Gonna look for the on in the back. I just need to chill real quick. I don't want to guide. I don't want to go into Artem's Ana. This Ryan could come to the back and pick me off. Oh, what a pull! <gasps> the boop almost killed me. Dang, they calling out dives and plat. These guys are goaded. Just making sure we cap, and now we can go walk up with our team and just look for the picks. A monkey's in now, so we can roll in, going pretty hard here. Oh, I thought he had primal. Unlucky. I should have said my nade for when that Ryan tried to pin into me. That's my own fault. If we can, since they're not doing it, especially in these lower ranks, taking high ground here can be phenomenal for us. Although we're taking a lot of poke right now, I gotta chill. Now we're getting heals. We're gonna go quick. I'm gonna go really quick, try and take this high ground from them. Hopefully this Bastion doesn't see me roll up here. And now we just... How did we get up here? Is that my life weaver? Oh, I should have just stayed up there. I tried to peek out for heals. I was dumb. I gave up my position. That's crazy that she took that pedal up there. That sucks. Oh, well. We're using a beat. We just have to walk down main and really try and take this advantage fight with our team that we have. Uh oh. I really need to peek behind. I can't. I just need to get out. Any kills? Damn. Oh my god. Captain. Guys, fucking dipping the shit out of me. Uh, I'm gonna use my bomb and go right. I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I'll go heavy heals. I'll go heavy heals. You can go around if you want. Just try and take high ground and shoot them from above. They won't know what to do. Do that, do that. Take high ground now. Leave I'll heal you. Go. Oh, shit. Oh, that works too. Oh, that's good pick, good pick. Why is a bastion over here? Oh, I just didn't get... They didn't notice. Damn. Oh, why is that Bastion over there? Me. It's really odd. Oh well. Let's yeah, just go down with the team. Did. I can ask my oh, wife ever to throw me up a pedal. It's what I should have done in the first place. Oh, DPS are back. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm lagging here. Is it, just, is it just me or are you guys lagging too? Hey, Life Weaver, can you throw a pedal so I can get high? Thanks, buddy. Oh my god, I'm terrible. It didn't give me the little jump thing, it's my bad. I'm gonna need to try and take an off angle flank here. Try and get some a pick and get some value. Look for their Ana, that's her sweep out. And just walk back with our team. Damn, how are we dying there? That's cool. I would like to apologize because I started lagging really, really hard right there. I don't know if I All was good. I'm going Ryan. I'm gonna nano you as soon as I can, right? So get ready for that. 
Gotta yep. sip it, gotta sip it, get him, get him, get him, get him! I literally got him as low as I can. Let's get, let's get I just needed to wait a second to heal. I don't want to get headshot by the Cass. He's oh one. no. I think the Brig's sleeping on him, guys. Stay in the car, stay in the car. I got card. I still want two, three on card. Two, three on card so we can push as fast as possible. And we really just need to poke out this Ryan as much as we can here. We're not gonna be able to touch, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go take this high ground. We hear cast over here, so we gotta be careful. Make sure we roll so that Ryan can't pin us. No, it wasted. No, I'm sorry. Why do we throw that nade there? That Ryan's gonna be able to. Oh, Freak Sun's crazy. Ryan Brig low, unfortunate. Bro, I jumped to the top of pedal. I hit my head or something. Not gonna happen. Hey, right, go left. Alright, let's speed us, go right. Go, 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 go. Here we Wait, it's a Wooster, right? Oh no. There we go. Now we need to go take high ground. I just want to inform you guys that Ryan booked me off the ledge and I fought so hard to get back and <laughs> break off, so. Get on the car, get on the car. I need to push I'm up. I'm on car, I'm on car, baby. Don't worry. I'm on car. I'm not letting go of car. And then we're just going to play on this high ground here, but we're playing to the back of this high ground. Why? It's because if we get headshot, we really need to, we're really just going to want to roll off the top. I'm never going to be able to kill Cass from there, so I just have to chill. Literally Try to hit the brig with a nade. It's like, it's like, it's like. This is a good push. Yeah, I can't believe our Lucio lived there. That was crazy. We're going to hold better than them. We got this. Man, I'm getting fucking tossed around like a little boy. No, 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 no. What you got on... So for defense, we want to hold position A highlighted in the yellow on the left. We want to hold this because it plays best to our ideal range on Cassidy, and we can play on this cover on our right side, roll back if we need to. But we also have the option of holding in position B highlighted in the red here. And we'd want to use this position highlighted in the red if they start pushing cart forward closer to the position in the red, so we can still play towards our ideal range, but also rotate back if we need to with our team. We lose. No offense to them, but I am going to mute this real quick just to uh, focus up, try and be a little bit more educational since they're talking a lot. As I do, all the 15-year-old children. Oh, that explains it. And here, we're just really playing high ground, playing close to cover in case we get headshot. We want to back off so we can get healed. And we're really just looking to put out damage here. Watch out, make sure we juke that nade. Now we can take oh, there on Widow now, so we gotta be a little careful. We don't have enough range to two tap that Widow, so we really just have to chill. I'm gonna try and wait for this Widow to make a mistake, or she's not looking at us. She's paying attention to us now, so I just have to chill. I wanna keep my high ground here. Even if we're just shooting the Ryan, it's fine. We really just wanna live right now. I'm trying to jiggle peek, see where this Widow's at. Now we can try and kill her. Unfortunate. Make sure we juke that nade. Now we can hop back up. Uh oh. Our mercy is gonna die for that. I really just have to chill here for like five seconds until my heal passive starts kicking in. Now we can try and peek something. Try and juke a Ryan Fire Strike for full health now so we can look for this Bastion. He has no support, so he's gonna die. And then look here, 
Just because we kept this high ground this entire fight and didn't die, look at how much value we got. We burned a minute and a half off, and we, we're still winning these fights. And they're off. We're going to go try and grab Mercy and get that damage boost for us. There we go. Save that roll for Bastion Alt. If he hits us, so I call, or if he hits right on top of us, we can roll away from it and try and juke the rest. Ping there. What? It, our teammates know that there's someone chilling there. Oh, Reinhardt's over here. We should go help out. Save our nade in case this Ryan wants to pin in. He drops, so we're good to use our nade now. Now we're gonna go peek down main, try and catch this Ana or Bastion, whoever we see first. Our mercy's crazy with these reses. And then see, we save our nades, so then in case that Ryan wants to pin at us, it just drops his pin. He's not going to be able to slam anyone into a wall. Wish he would slam me into a wall. Wait, pause? Um, anyways, back to the game. Just keep, put, keep applying pressure. Playing near cover, and then we're going to roll out. Wait for our supports. Ooh, our sojourn's really in there. This is something you don't want to do, guys. They have Ryan that can just shield that. He's has full shield. There's no reason to use an overclock there. What we can do is pop our ult. We got a lot of attention looking away from us. Push their team back pretty far. And looks like we're going to lose this fight. But it is what it is. We just need to try and get out to our best of our ability. Just keep running. Don't even turn around and shoot. Now we go take high ground. That's a huge bomb. What happened to the Rhine? And we want to... Why are we going to stay up here and not push with our team? Uh, hopefully they back out. If they go in really hard, we're going to go... We need to go in with our team. I want to keep that high ground. It's, it takes me forever to get back up on this high ground. If, but they're pushing in, we need to push with them. If one or two people go in here and die, well, then they're feeding. But if we go in as a team, we're making a play. We're stalling them here and making a play. Ideally, we want to just chill on that high ground. But it is what it is. We're not able to. So we're not going to cry about it. We're just going to play the play that we have. We're just going to make it work, guys. Save that nade. Oh, shit. We're going to go take high ground again. Do that nade in case he's pinned at right at us. But now with us taking high ground here, we're going to be able to make a really strong play here. We got Brig out of the fight. It's really good for us. We're just going to keep taking different off angles on him. Like, look at this Bastion here. And there we go. Hey guys, I think we just hold right here. Because if we can just keep this high ground, it's going to be really impossible for them to push with us on Ryan. And so now, since our team's playing here, we can just keep this high ground, really just looking to shoot whoever we see first. There's a Bastion ult coming in. Looks like he already dropped it. Okay. Hold over there. Try and help the teammate out. We can push in and kill this honor right here. Honor on Lucio. I'll finish that kill. Oh, he was one. Nice, Bastion. And since they're on Widow here, we're going to try and play close. The further we are away from this Widow, the harder it's going to be for... Or the further we are away from the Widow, the easier it is for her to kill us. We're out of our range. Makes the shots easier for us as well, since the Jukes will be slower. 
Now we're just gonna bully this prig from ever getting to the Rhine. Oh, ouch. Okay, we're finding ourselves out of position here. We're just really gonna right click this Rhine down. With the tracer, we don't wanna force our shots. We're just gonna wait for her to walk back into our crosser and then pull the trigger. Ryan's gonna touch. Oh, never mind. GG. GG, guys. Well played. <laughs> this Bastion kind of suicide, just a little bit. Most useful high noon, honestly. High noon's a terrible ultimate, so a lot of times just use it to re -ult or to reload. All right, what is our predicted rank after game two? Gold one. On Esperanca, we're going to want to take the right flank as quick as possible here. We want to get there as quick as possible because the team that controls this right flank typically wins the first fight. Okay. Anyway, starting off this map here, playing down main. Yo, oh, thanks for the host, bro. How was your stream? Okay, anyways, we're just gonna be focusing. Now as well. Waiting for deflect to go out before we throw our nade. And also, we can just toss our nade out here and just finish getting picks. Gonna try and pick him off. Yeah, he's not, not gonna be able to. So we're going to stay here at first, really just getting poke damage. And as they're pushing in, they're pretty close, so we're going to start kiting back. They push in, we push back. And now, as the spice engaging, we're going to go walk up to high ground. Saving our roll in case some something goes down. Looking for this Lucio since he's out in the open. I need to get back with my team. This Genji's forcing me off height. I don't want to be stuck up there. Oh my god. I'm just rolling back to a health pack. I'm not even going to risk getting healed. And at five seconds, our heal passive will start kicking in right now. Oh, wow. That was a lucky shot. That's Arissa's goal, and we can really just try and put out damage on her. Oh, shit, bro. I didn't think I'd take that much damage. Anyone else the stream go black? Uh, maybe reset. Hello, good stream. Oh, heck yeah. Have you been up? Really just fo looking to force out this Orisa here. We already got a pick, so we can go walk on their teammates now. I don't know why I right clicked. Yeah. Don't be like me. Don't right click someone unless you already have a nade on them or they're a tank. That was just yours? Okay. And then right here again, they're going to be coming through window. So we're in playing in our perfect range. If they peek through this window, we'll be having max damage here. So we can just keep this high ground. Force this Genji to come out of position to dash on us if he wants to. We already got a pick, so it's looking like we can peek out a little bit further. I'm going to go ahead and drop. Just going to wait for the Sarissa to finish her golden. Look for the Lucio while she's golden. Then we can just go walk him down now. Now we got a teammate there. We can push forward. Like, if there's an Orisa Golden, guys, there's almost zero reason to shoot her. Unless she's very low, you do such minimal damage. It's like, you might as well not even be shooting her. Try and hit him with an early nade. Oh, I didn't get enough heals, damn. 
Bueno, aquí. No, es just a lot of damage. Uh, mainly the ladder opposite to, uh, to teach others how to do a character. So I put like a week or so of time into Casty really getting him down to do this one for you. For you all. I'm getting out. Now we're just playing tight to cover. That's the golden rule of almost all DPS, playing next to cover. I'm gonna kill that Bash first just to make sure he doesn't kill any of my teammates. When are you gonna do the tur the Mercy on Race Gym that you totally promised and I said I'm not making up? Bro, if I'm making a full-time income off content creation, I'll eventually get one out for you guys, but not until then. Lucio's out in the open, so we're gonna look for him first. I'm way... Look at how far an off angle I am. I almost got punished for that. Our Arissa was not pushed up far enough for me to rotate right. I should have died there to that Arissa. That was a big mistake on my end. Showing in this corner for a second. I'm gonna roll away. Really, we just need to be looking for their back line here. Oh, I'm so dead. That's unfortunate. Oh, our sojourn's crazy. Got stuck on the fence chain, yeah. Looking for this Lucio. Genji's close to us. In our range where we can get that two tap kill. So we go for him first. I'll go grab cart for our team. I'll let our Kiri push it. I want to fight with our team here. If they come push us, it's pretty good for us. Our Kiri can still push cart pretty freely. Looks like they are going to go for cart though. But what that means is we can take this top high ground right here. This is Arissa's not gonna... Oh, they're on Malga now. This Malga's not gonna be able to push us. We're all up here. So, real, in all honesty, we're just chilling right now. Look for that Lucio first since he's out of position on looking at us. And now, we don't want to take damage from that Arissa or the... Or not the Arissa, the Honor or the Genji. So we just stay in cover and shoot the Malga that whole time. Did I just headshot that Lucio, or was that the Bastion? Oh, that's a Malga Nano. We're just gonna back up. I haven't seen Honest Sleep Dart yet, so I really don't want to shoot. He's dead anyways. Look, we take that flank on the left there because we see our Ressa here, so we know that we'll be safe. And we can try and catch someone out of position, just like we did with that Lucio. I'm gonna look for this Ana that's just scoped in back there. Should be some easy shots on her. At least force her out to where she can't heal anyone that's touching. There we go. GG. Play of the game. Play of the game.
Wait, what was it? Predicted rank? Plat 5. Alright. On this map here, I'm going to pop out this little right window. I don't want to walk down main because if they have a Widow, that's the spot she always looks first. So we can kind of jiggle peek up here. They don't have Widow, so we can fall down. That Doomfist just feeding, so we punish him first. Looks like our Kiri's going to grab point for us. We can try and get a nade off on Soldier, maybe pick him off. There we go. Our Widow's popping off too. Nice shots, buddy. Nice shots, Galbunga. Thank you. Gotta hype up the homies, bro. I want to play here on this left side, though, because playing on right side leaves us more of a chance to get caught out. So even though we're playing a little more in the open, we can immediately roll back to cover. We'll be safe. And they don't have a Widow to pick us off. We hear their Diva going bottom left. So I'm going to go try and put some damage. We're going to look for the Soldier first. I'm going to reload, make sure no one's down main. Look for a nade on someone. We got the Wusio. I'm just going to keep looking for their squishies. Just constantly looking for squishies. Oh my gosh, if I could hit a shot. Yeah, that's my own fault. I should have killed that Lucio. Still a good push from us. I just wasn't missing, or I just wasn't landing enough shots there. In all honesty. <laughs> One in 19 in session once. Damn, that's rough. The mental to keep climbing that when going that much on a loss streak is crazy, though. So props. Yeah, it's going to use the flex so we can really look. I'm going to look for a pick on this diva here. Oh, no. No, I didn't have my roll up. Why did we? Oh, we used Bell so early. I can't believe she has her ult that quick, too. It's a big misplay on me. I really did not think she would have that ultimate. Doom, please don't ever do that again. Oh, nice pull. We can look at this diva. Diva, 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 we're just gonna keep looking at Diva because she is so low. Now we can look at someone else. Nice shot. Wait, wait, where the fuck are you go? Oh my god, my aim. Aim, Kieran, aim, aim, aim. Oh my god. Thank god Cal Bunga can do a shot because I sure can't. And then really here, we're just playing down main. Playing down main. The Lucio's out of position. We're going to look for him first. Uh, damn. Missed um. my shot. Nice shot. And instead of walking down main here, because our Widow can just easily pop up and look at us. Moira? We're going to walk down this right side. We're gonna play a little oh, further back, except we're gonna. Oh, we have that widow venom mine on us. Look for the life reaver first. Dang, I did not play very good that round. You don't have the sound on when eliminating. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> Alright, we need to watch for the Widow here. We'll know who they're playing in about five more seconds. So we're going to roll through, try and play around the corner. Is 
They're on cast soldiers, so we can kind of just play around this corner here. Really just bully this ball real quick. He'd already used his roll into us, so there's no way he's going to get out from that. Ooh. We're behind cover. I need to roll behind drum so we can get healed. It's still it. Looks like we're not getting healed. Oh, well. We have a passive that'll heal us. We're gonna roll here. Oh. I thought Cassis are gonna be there, so we try to throw that nade early and try and catch him out. Gotta watch this left side here, too. Gonna get that pile on, and then we're just gonna back out. Then we're gonna play tight to cover, tight to cover, guys. Remember, we heard, saw that Zenyatta with a right click, and since we're playing tight to cover, what did we do? We just got to walk right back. If we're out in the open, he can catch us out and keep peeking that corner. That's why you play tight to cover right there, especially on heroes like Casty, Soldier, Hanzo. There's really no reason for me to be peeking right here. They're all still in spawn. I have my ultimate. All we're going to do is give them more ult charge if we do damage. And we're outside of our range, so we have zero chance to pick anyone off. But we have a chance to get right quick by the Zenyatta. It's really just not worth it for us here. I'm going to hit him with that nade earlier, so it's hard for him to jump out on us. We're there on Widow now, so we just back out. Walk away. We don't peek that. Peeking that is just an ego peek, and that's gonna lose us the game. We let our widow deal with that. Oh, why the fuck did you just walk behind me? And not oh no, I'm dead, guys. Oh no. Bless you, wooden pole. GG, what played? Yo, Cowbung mm. is cooking? Yeah, we're still in placements. We're only in game three, or this was just game four, so. Plat four. There's been so many people playing Hell Divers. This first point is very hard for Cassidy. If you guys play other heroes, I'd honestly suggest not playing Cassidy on this one. Why is that? Just because there's such long sight lines that it's really hard to get any kind of value. And there's only one flank you can take, really. You can go through bus, but it's really easy to be caught out or the little train up top. You go left side, you can flank over there, but you really have to. Like, it's just too long of sight lines for it to be useful. So what we're going to be trying to do here is just play with our team and maybe take the little room on the left if we get a chance to and roll in there. Right click that barrier. Try and burn it down as quick as we can. Then we're going to roll here. Play safe for a second. Just burn down that barrier. It looks like they're going up main for some reason. We're just going to stay down here. Oh. Anytime that buries up, we're just going to try and right click it for the most part. Just burn down barrier. That's a big pick for us. The sig's low. We can look for this cast now. They're not going to be able to get him. This mercy might look for us. There we go. And if you notice that Cassidy, we didn't force our shots there. So it allowed us to hit more shots. If we're forcing our shots, that's when you get anxious. That's when you're going to start over flicking, under flicking. And be like, oh, oh, I have to hit the shot. If you just chill, take your time. Don't spam your, your primary fire as fast as you can. It'll allow you to hit more shots. I got to get out. You force out Mercy Res so that she won't res have res again until 440. So if we kill someone in the next 10 seconds, they will not be able to be resed. Oh, unlucky. Almost got her.
This cast has a pocket, so we really have to be careful. I'm just gonna drop under right now. Waiting for someone to drop on us. Really, I want to be up there helping my team, but we're getting a lot of card progress right now. I'm gonna go ahead and get out. Maybe they won't remember us here. Ah, uh, I didn't hit this up. Should've just went for a second shot. Damn. Jesse McCree is such an iconic name, yeah. I understand why they changed it though. I don't blame them. Cole Cassidy still sounds pretty cool. Or Cassidy, uh, not so much Cole, but. Oh no, keep walking left, trying to get away from that castle. And now we're just gonna get on with our whole team. We killed four, they're not gonna be able to touch. Especially because they just swapped Ash, so they're not gonna have Bob. Cap that with my team, now we can go up, try and get this pick on Ash or Casty. I kind of want this diva to use her boosters. I don't want her to use them on me. So what we're gonna do is The diva is not paying attention to us. We're gonna back off here. The diva can easily come use her boosters on us Just like she is now, but we can get out. See if we played too far up that diva would have boosted on us Hit her with all of our missiles. Would have been killed by Ana as well. Gonna wait a second. We're gonna roll back I'm gonna keep kiting back and out now we're going to peek out because they're not going to be ready for us. I think we got a ran away. We're just going to get out here. Oh well. This is a huge one with Dave. Pick out left side here, see if there's anyone peeking bottom left that we can pick off. I'm gonna peek right side here, there's a little health pack we can grab. It's gonna be really hard for that merge to go for the res. Aw, oh, she can res so far away, bro. I forget. A little too far away, if you ask me. Um, I'm, I think I'm behind a fire truck, Miss Anna. That's Steve's booster, so we need to walk up left side here, really just play to our advantage that we have, or in our range, rather. Playing in our range is what gives us the advantage. We're just gonna walk out. She doesn't have her ult yet, or her mech back, I mean. We're just gonna be able to walk out, and we're chilling now. Oh, I wanted to kill her. I just wasn't hitting any headshots. My ultimate, we're really only gonna be able to use it to reload because they have Ana and Diva. Diva can just fly into us, make it to where we can't really get any value. I'm really just trying to play around this corner so I can get healed. Oh, almost. Oh, she ate it? No way.
Need to go on a flank look for this Mercy here. I'm gonna, yeah. Damn, man. Uh, probably place like Diamond. I don't know. My, I don't think I'd place Diamond. I'd place somewhere in Plat. Those shots. I'll be watching out for that tracer over here. Our Ryan's just really not doing anything at all, unfortunately. But, oh well, is what it is. No hate Winston on defense. But just this guy, uh, I'm not... Oh well. I'm gonna play this left side here, really looking to try and get a two tap on somebody. Probably not gonna be able to. We're just gonna have to kite back out. We just have to run away. There is no way we're gonna get a pick here with that soldier and have a pocket. We just have to get back and recontest. Yeah, we just gotta get out. We're down to just get out. I feel like Diva or Zarya would be really good here if you play it. Yeah, might be a little, little bit far spot. All good. There's a Sojourn up here. Can we go on her? Oh. Nice. Called that out because she's out in the open. There's a cast over here. He might go top left. Did he jump this cast? He's left side. Oh, he dropped. Sorry. My bad. Now we just need to be looking for a pick. That's really all we can do. We have to play roll ground here so we can play in our range. As they're pushing in, we can kite out to still play in our range. Nice plays, monkey. And there we go. Wait. Okay. I'm not gonna stay up there anymore. There's a way you can get up there just by crouch jumping. It's hard though. We can burn her down quick. If Mercy wants to go for a res, I have my ult. Oh shit. That's why I'm not a fan of Mercy. Why is this an wing? I hype for this ball rework. I'm surprised they're reworking him, honestly. I don't think he needs it, in my opinion, but. I need to play over here on this left side because if we play by playing on this left side it's gonna force someone to come peek out to me on this window how did his nade hit me there's nothing I can do I really want to ask for a Zen or a mercy it's just so hard to deal with anything like I can't shoot their diva really it's really hard to duel either of their DPS because they have a pocket. 
So I really just have to play super smart and try and outplay these guys. Like, I have to fall off high ground since our sorry is holding far back. We can't hold that anymore. We can hold this for three minutes. Alright, we're really just gonna try and stay on this right angle. Try and force the diva out so we can get some value. Just showing one HP, that sucks. Like, how is this guy constantly alive? Damn, how's that Mercer? Our more is tracking her like crazy. I'm gonna go hop on this little right angle here. We can get that little head glitch, try and peek at someone. We're gonna have to fall back. We can't I can't go up there, the diva will just blow me up. Especially with Akiri, there's no chance we'd ever kill anybody. So we just keep this low ground here. Try and keep looking for another kill if we can. Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't... <laughs> that was such a brain dead play. Can she not re-mech when I have that nade on her? Look at Mercy, look at Mercy. She's one. Now I can pick up, try and go get this Ash here. Oh, if I only had that Mercy there. I'm gonna get out. Now we're being too risky. Shouldn't have jumped there. Jumping is a terrible habit. I don't know how I picked that habit up recently. I'm gonna go play a little bit on this left side here. It's gonna put us in a better angle for us to get really use our range to our advantage grab that health pack now we slide out we just need to kite back oh shit what a shield bro Nice. Clutched a tough game. Good job, Matt. You popped off. Oh, yeah. Thanks for being willing to swap, too. Hey, you got it, man. What a nice guy. What a nice guy. He did pump out a lot of damage that game, though. Ooh, nice shot. Ooh, nice shots. Ooh, nice shots. Yeah, we're going crazy. I don't think she can remake while hindered, no? Oh, dang.
Bro. GG's. For them. Alright, we're gonna start on this top left here. Really should have broken down these barriers. We're gonna have to roll out. We're taking poke. We're just gonna get out. We can grab this health pack real quick. Here we go. You go around this right side. See if we can't get this widow. Not gonna be able to. We're over there for a while. She's gonna be ready for us now, so I'm gonna peek a different angle. Looks like she's probably not gonna be ready for us again. I'm gonna jiggle peek, make sure she's not over here. I think widow is on height. Yep, she's on high. Got her pinged. Oh, the six. I need help. Oh, bro, my supports are actually like. Well, they're pot. I, I can't get mad at them. Of course they At least it's on your team again, true. Alright. Jiggle peek, make sure that widow's not booking for us. We heard that widow up top, so we got ready for it. Made it an easier shot since we had that crosshair placement. Oh, on a one, on a one. Oh man, get him ball. That was a. Uh... Okay, that works. Wow. Gonna wait till we get healed up a bit. Now we can go look for some more shots. Us, uh, she's one. Nice. Oh my god. <laughs> we traded. It's okay. Oh, Suzu's crazy. That's what I was thinking, bro. I think I heard her Suzu, too. I think she just missed it, in all honesty. Since Soldier's up here, we're gonna go take high ground. Gonna try and already hop up there, try and catch him off guard a little bit. Big my anti. We can go peek on this right side if we take any more poke. We can go grab a health pack. We didn't grab it first because our health passive was kicking in. We didn't want to have... We didn't want to use it if we didn't have to. I'm gonna juke back out. Try to stay away from this sig, playing behind cover in case he wants to rock us. We can drop back. See? That's why we play cover. Sig wants to rock, we drop back immediately. You know what? I'm just gonna kill the Lucio first die. instead. Sig actual one, nice. Ooh, ooh. Nice. Okay, I fed. Kinda thought we'd all go in there, that's my fault. Yo, thanks, Leaf Green. What's up, bro? gonna roll and stay on this right side that's her spear three two one i'm gonna go touch oh we got speared off damn good good hold though really good hold for us uh-oh that's no bueno no it's okay we get him back even or not the game's still super winnable They'll have fun in games until they play Orisa. True. Let's kill this Orisa. Oh no.
That sucks. I have to go take high ground here, even though I don't really want to. It's gonna be our only chance. If we touch, we win this. They're, they only have three alive. Oh, this versus on me. I'm gonna die. Can you pocket me? On a one, I got her. You guys win this. Oh my gosh. So why did I push high ground there? Look, guys, let's think about it. Pushing high ground, even if they know I'm there, it's gonna be give me an opportunity for me to go take high ground behind them and take an off angle from behind them. And let's say they, like if that's if they don't chase me. If they do chase me, it gives me an opportunity to get a 1v1 duel on that Kiriko, just like I did. And she's walking into me, so it's gonna make the shots a little bit easier to hit. And that's why I got the three tap her there. This Kiri TP'd in on right side. Where's the one? Nice bubble. Uh, she's one, actually one. Oh, I shouldn't have peeked that. Fucking ego peek, you dumbass Kieran, bro. Oh, that's so dumb of me. So dumb of me, bro. So, so dumb of me. I just threw that fight for us. We can win this. Just, just pocket monkey, try and get him health back up. Soldier and soldier and soldier, nice. Soldier one, right side. We can win this, even if he doesn't join back. We're so much better than them. Dude's not coming back. Yeah, he probably had like an internet DC or like power outage or something. That was Masters last season, man. I'm gonna roll under, try and get to this bottom left side. If the Tracer wants to fight me, so be it. I have a health pack I can roll to. Grab health pack, now we can go in a bit. Hey, look at this soldier. Oh no, I got myself way out of position. I thought we could have walked in. Damn, and I wasn't paying attention that my Simmon died. Yeah, he's got high ground control, we need to get him off. Yeah, ball or some kind of dive might be good here. I wish I could go Genji or something and try and just duel this soldier off the high ground. I'm gonna need to walk left again, just make sure that this Lucio's not here to boop me. There we go. Is Sigma trying to get out? I think he's trying to get out. So we can go climb up here. If we have high ground, it's going to give us a really good opportunity to just pick whoever's left. I'm going to hit the Lucio first. He's the most out of position. There we go. We got Sigma too. That's really good for us. I'm going to just get a few of us on cart. Soldier one, soldier one. Aw, oh, damn. We got him. I'm with you. I go aggressive here. I'm gonna go aggressive. Nice heals. You're insane. We win these boys. Get Diva. Look at soldier, soldier one. Oh, I should not be right clicking. 
Sorry, I'm not being super educational right now, guys. I'm trying just my hardest to win this game just because we're down one. But same same rules always apply. Always playing tight to cover. And trying just to pick out whoever's the most out of position in front of their team. The thing that Cassidy's really good at is just punishing the enemy team for making mistakes. We saw Spear come out, so I'm going to try and look for an opportunity to ult somebody. Tracer's on me. Arissa one. Nice. Looking Tracer. Oh, uh, what a beat. Oh, there's the health pack. There's no reason for me to feed. I'm going to go take high ground really quick. We have three minutes. We win this easy. I'm going to roll back immediately because that Arisa is going to have spear. We don't want to get hit by spear. We're getting pocketed right now, so we're really just chilling. Oh my god, that spear hit me. Damn. I trolled that. My bad. We gotta play all together because I really have one. Yeah. Other. I like I the road hog pick. Also, like something like Widow would be really good right here when you guys are, like, if this, if you were in a similar situation, but obviously I can't because cast on rank to GM. That's huge. We just walk in on him. I'm gonna play from low ground. Orisa's looking for an ultimate. Don't do what I just did. I got stuck and rolled immediately. Wait to roll. If I waited to roll there, I, I we would have lived and probably won that fight. Really bad mistake on my end. Huge pick. We're almost back with four. Watching for this tracer up here. We got tracer. I'm dead. I'll let you guys. We kill this Arissa here. Nice. You guys are insane. If we do that, boys, let's go. GG. Let's fucking go, dude. We won the 4v5. That was a really nice pulse, though. But yeah, I, I made a big mistake. <laughs> yeah, nice switch, dude, on, on Hog. That was sweet. Yeah, big... Heck yeah, dude. Let's go. That, that, one, that one feels good. Oh, come on. Just put me diamond five after that game. Went in a 4v5. <laughs> Shoot down at the ground and then pop yourself back up. Yeah, you off angle on cast. Um, but you don't take like really deep, hard off angles like you would on soldier. Like really hard flanks. Always trying to off angle when you can. But there's some, against some comps, you just can't. All right, right now we're really just looking to get poke. I can't really walk in do do much. Ready, speed us in. We will go right side. Ready, three, two, one. Right, 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 right. Go right, go right, go right, go right, go right. Get the run, get the run, get the run, get the run. We're gonna make, make, make. Let's see. We're just waiting. Keep me up, 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 keep me up. Wait for that dynamite to go off. Damn. Kill Ryan. Nice. Now we look at the junk because he's the most out of position. Just roll right. Look for the Ana. Yeah, we 
get everyone on. We'll just cap it so fast they won't be able to do anything. Watching high ground in case this chunk wants to pop up. Right here, I'm going to have to try and go off angle. Why are we going to off angle? Because there's a junk spamming me down. Ash is playing at her range. And there's a Ryan shield in front of me. So what am I going to be able to do? My shield is just now we're just yeah, going to chill. There. It's fine. They're popping, what, two, three ults there? We're going to chill. See if I can't get into the back and line real quick. And right after we got the point. Now we get to make a play. We're not going to look to ult here. Why are we not going to look to ult? Because their Ana is just going to immediately shrine, sleep shrine, us and we shrine, die. Shrine, 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 shrine. But what we can do is we can get, go ahead and roll up here. And just put out a fuck ton of damage right behind him. Peek away. Act like we're not here. And now we can look to go kill this junk rat. Junk one right side. Nice kill. And we can roll over here. Look to pick whoever is trying to get out. I think it's just the Ash wife. Oh, there's a wife over here too. Just roll back to our team, try and get healed. Don't want to risk dying. We're going to get a couple on cart real quick. For as long as we can. And we're going to go do the same thing here. We're going to go take another off angle. A flank on this left side. Typically you don't want to be doing it. But since we're into this comp, we really have to be looking for this. We're going to play as tight to this corner as we can when we're looking. There we go. We got a pick. Now we go back to our team. Do that. We have our roll back up so we can go take another flank again. They're going to be unaware. Now they're aware of us, so we chill. We walk right back. Wait for our heal passive to kick in. Now we can walk back in. Use our roll to dodge a sleep. I'm just gonna have to run deeper in their back line. There's really nothing else I can do. Damn. They're on a or their ash came back in time. Let's see. Imagine if we just sit with our team the entire time there and we're just shooting a Rhine Shield. What are we gonna accomplish? That's why we're we have to since we're playing Cassidy. We have to take those flanks. We have to take those off angles so that we can still get value, because there's just not enough open space in a small map like King's Row where we'll look at these just narrow sight lines. And they have an Ash playing long range. We have to take those flanks. That's honest sleep. We can try and catch her out here. We're playing so far to where this Ryan won't be able to do anything, really. We just chill. Kite back. Kite back around the corner. Why is that? Because we're never going to be able to win a fight with a sim wall in front of us. So we just chill here. Either force them to come out of position to try and kill us. Or we just stall it out. And look, they got nothing done with that ultimate. All they did is waste time. Ah, oh, damn. Our Ryan got picked. Unfortunate. Three alts in the last 30 seconds? Just die or get out. All they can have is Bob and Cole coming up. Oh no. I'm gonna walk right side, try and take one of these off angles. I have to reload. I'm never gonna be able to just one tap somebody. Oh, that is getting healed so much. I'm not gonna be able to kill that thing. Damn. Ash headshot. Okay. Okay. Clip it. Clip it. That was that was nasty, guys. That was nasty. And I didn't even hit any crazy shots there. It's just all crosshair placement, letting them walk into the crosshair. Makes it so much easier. Take the time to line up that last shot.
That was kind of crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Bro, just different. <laughs> yeah, it's, I, it sucks that you can't clip it, Shard. Yo, Musashi, what up, bro? Alright, right now we're just playing down main. We're really just looking to put out some damage. Oh no, our Ryan's screwed. We need to take this right angle while they're pushing in. Juke back. Juke away that soldier and has her. Sergeant had a rail, so we wanted to be careful there. Once she used it, we could really peek out harder. Uh, I think I just went up to plat three prediction, but either way, plat, plat three or plat four. Oh shoot. I have to try and get back quick. Now we're gonna take this off angle again so we, we can get easier shots off rather than just staring at Orion the entire fight. I just need to back up. Back up, chill. Oh, With Orion being down, it's really bad. So I have to look to try and go make a play here. On a one. Can you yeah, can you I cannot. I'm sleeping. I'm just gonna let him kill me. I'm not gonna be able to get out. Nice try with the nano on her. Just a tad bit unfortunate timing. Tim, I I honestly don't know, man. Like, only thing I could say is play a role that doesn't require you to out aim a Zim or a Smurf, or a role or a hero. Or in something like May if you're DPS, um, Ana if you're on support, you can still make plays that are impactful enough to carry, even against those Smurfs and console players. Or if you're on tank, play D.Va, control the space they're trying to push into. But ah, oh, damn. Lucio coming up on you, soldier. Oh, let's go. Oh, I thought I rolled. I thought I rolled. Damn. Wasn't quick enough. They still haven't seen my aim. Watch out for that enemy. I appreciate it. Fire. You have nano? Nano me, nano me. On an enemy, an enemy, an enemy. Here again, we're gonna go look for an off angle. Oh my god. Oh my god. I got scared. I choked. Oh, she's not in VC. Big sad. That sucks. Unfortunate we didn't use alts there. We go in shot. Here. We're gonna keep. Yep. And keep playing on this right side, trying to create off angles, getting a look at someone. There we go. Got a pick. Oh, that's on porch. We saw, we saw a headshot. There we go. Now we're playing tight to this corner as we peek out. In case Ana tries to sweep us or we get headshot and take a lot of damage.
just kite back. There's nothing we can do here. Oh no, monkey. Be careful, buddy. And now our, our soldier's already on that off angle, so we're going to play down main and still try to keep some pressure on this Ryan. I'm holding my nade here in case this Ryan wants to try and pin into us. Huge pick. And there we go. Now we're just going to walk up with our team. Did their soldier get out, I guess? No, I, I booked her up on that. Oh, I didn't see that. Nice. They're pushed in, we're pulling back. Always playing tight to cover. We still won? Might have grabbed health back though. Oh my god. Oh, he got melted. Oh, that sucks. Oh my god. Oh, he blocked it right in time, bro. One second different. Damn. Rama. Ooh. Can you just try and jump like up behind him on high ground, monkey? Like bring attention towards you? Yeah, I like that. Damn, these guys really want this win going bash and ram, bro. I'm just chilling right now. Now we look for mercy. Nice. Huge pick. If we cap this right now, he gets a late spawn too. We can go push these guys. They don't have their tank with them. I'm coming with you. Nice. Good job, guys. We don't want to engage them out here, it's bad for us. I said we just get out. Try and build up ults. Oh no. What oh. The fuck? Bro, my, what are you? Map, my game just fucking froze. Oh, that sucks. Can you guys get that at all? We're gonna have to ult quick. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be there, I'll be there. That's a fortunate fucking time. Oh, bro, that's actually such a throw. I'll be there in three seconds. Good job, guys. We still have beats engage and primal after. Check during queue later. I'll check it out after. You might just have to remind me. Okay, we should beat here to engage. Reaper one, Reaper one. Reaper no fade left side, I can't chase him though. Reaper TP'd above. Oh, we just didn't get to get a kill with that, that sucks. Hey, really good push, it's alright.
Now, as usual, we're gonna start down main and then we're gonna rotate back around right side into this little hotel room. We can roll back to our team if we need to and we're just gonna keep kiting back. They're taking right room, so we just kite back. If our stick can push him out, we can go take right room with him. Uh, we need to rotate out right side and try and get a pick like we did before. She got belled, so we're not going to be able to get that kill anymore. I just got to try and get out. Now we're going to do this full rotation again. And look, look at how much space we're creating. Even though we're not getting any picks right now. Look, look. Look at how much we're actually doing. Notice, we didn't really get any picks there. We did at the end, but that's only because look at how much space we created, how much attention we drew. We brought the cast completely out of the fight. We forced the Kiri to TP out because we were right by her pressuring her. And we just opened up so much space and so much opportunity for our team to win that fight. Ah, uh, that little boot from his nade got me to not hit that last shot. Unlucky. Oh no, I did not know their honor was right there. Oh no. Oh wait, how did he get to full health? Did he get belled? And look, we're just gonna take our shots slow and then that's when we hit our shots. Take the shots slow, you hit the shots. Especially because we had nano, there's no way we're gonna die there. We weren't purple, we weren't nothing. GG Kredith, I guess. Whoo, wee. Nice job, guys. GG. Well played. Yeah, really clutch nano from our Ana. Plat two, baby. Let's go. Let me watch it back. Do anything. He's like the only hero I know how to play. I'm. I love you so much. Oh, there you go. You're the best. Oh my god. I would have let you play cast too. Just so you know. Holy. Oh, thanks, man. Love you too. All right, we're just playing around main here. We hear two on this left side. Gonna see if we can't go catch this tracer out. Oh, unfortunate. There we go, caught tracer out. Cast half alone. Cast one. There we go. Wow, aim. Why do we walk on that tracer first? Because we want to test the water, see how good she is, and see if we can't just like diff her right at the start of the fight, and then I'll make us go up one too. And then notice how we throw the nade first there. We throw the nade first to catch her off guard. Because if we shoot her first and then throw the nade after, she's going to have more than enough time to react. Even if she's not that great of a tracer. Oh, nice punch. She's going to have more than enough time to react to be able to recall. But if we hit her with that nade first, she's not going to be able to recall until after nade pops. Unfortunate, my bad. Oh, you're so close. Y'all are crazy though. Yo, Dots Fire, thanks for the fall, homie. How you doing? Just watching your Somna ranked gym? Oh, heck yeah.
Oh, we're gonna get back out. There's no way we're gonna win that. Their whole team's alive. Oh, we're up one for this next fight. We gotta walk around the corner. Um, how did she? Must have hit her right after. Aw, oh, damn. Are we already half? Aw, oh, damn. Tracer one. Oh man. Why does too much damage? And Doom just needs some freaking armor. Like at least fifty. The problem child movie. I don't know that movie. I'm surprised we lost that fight. She's getting healed from that turret. We'll never be able to kill her. Oh wait, we're alting in, huh? We just need to go fight with our team here. We can't go on left side. Cast caught out. Oh no 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 god damn it you got fucking dumbass Oh no bro There's no way I just did that No way in hell I just did that No bro it's okay we come back and kill everybody They're down two we win these Down three we definitely win these Use that all to for sure get damage off on like Lucio, and then we could just follow up with an easy one shot right after. On um, one, actually. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, almost. Though the edge was tactical and made you walk in for the nice fight. Real, real. That's what it was. We're gonna roll back a bit. We don't wanna be caught out so far up there. We just play point. Oh, our Ana's caught out though. We gotta be careful. We might have to kill for her. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Uh, Genji on our Ana. There we go. Keep an eye on that Ana so we can kill her for her when need be. Oh, we already has Nade on her. More half. Oh, freak. She does not want to die, bro. Goodness. I, I've done an unranked GM on Sombra. If you go check my channel, it was like the last one that I did. What is that pile on? She must try to hit it on the wall or something. And now we just really play tight to this corner right here. We need a backup since we're down our Ana.
We just have to get out. We can't win that. I'm gonna try and see if I can maybe get an ult off on this left side here. Wow, that was a that was a play by their Genji. Yo, frogs, thanks for the follow, homie. Oh, uh, Raphael, I think she's good in all ranks, in all honesty. Gotta drop my all that diva flew over. Yeah, unfortunate. Yo, Naomi, thanks for the follow, dude. How you doing? Lucky shot. Now we look for their Mora, she's out of position. Have they nanoed? Because I think they have both support alts if they don't. We need to play close here because if they call, we don't want to be ca getting caught out in the open from coal essence. We need to ult first here. Walk in with our soldier, pocket him. Eva dies, nice. Just staying in this corner because I'm not noticed yet. Nice, GG, well played, guys. Let's go, pimps. Dude, I thought I'd be able to catch the uh, Genji from not seeing me if he went on my Ana. Endorsed guy who gave me McCree, true. True. I did be better about that. Guard's right. Platinum two. Oh, one sec. I'm looking for. Oh, I mean, quick walk cast and. Do they have the so hard solid core? I mean, you can eat the whole thing. So no. It's like firm, I guess. All right, we're playing outside of this right window here because we really don't want to peek into this widow. We hear a hog coming up, so we're just going to have to roll through here and try and get out. Wow. I'm not going to be able to play up here since they have a hog. I'm just going to have to get back out. He's got his hook back up again. We're going to have to go down main. I'm just going to get out and go play off this high ground up here. Oh, I did not mean to hit that. That's hog hook, so we can peek for a little bit now. Cass is under us. Can someone help me? I fucking love you so much. I didn't know it was not in VC. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why playing to live is so important. Like, just making sure you're outside of hook range, trying to play around the Widow, not get sniped by her. Because we're able to get value the entire fight because of that. 
Nice pick. And that's why we start out right here, and as they start pushing in, we figure out where we want to go. Whether we stay right up here if no one's contesting us, or we rotate back left with our teammates. Careful the Widow, careful them pushing top right. I'm gonna roll out. Oh, go on this. We'll get the Kiri first. Nice. I'm just fucking tired of Ana's stuck. Dude. I'm looking at Ana. There we go. We're not gonna pick that widow. There's no chance we ever kill him. We'd have to hit him about three or four times Don't in the head. Him. There's just no reason to peek it. If nobody peeks, she gets no value. I heard that grapple, it sounded pretty close, so I thought maybe we might be able to pick her er, pick her off there. Only reason that we peeked. I need to walk down main. We heard Widow go right, so we should be careful here for a bit. I'm gonna try and play as far Top left right. as we can here. Top right, Widow. Just gonna keep rolling out. I don't have my roll to get out yet, so we just gotta be careful. She missed her shot, so we just walk right out. Widow still top right. They're down. Trying to look for the Ana behind the hog. There we go. They're down. Down both the boys. Who care? Thank you. She's one. I love you. There we go. They have no widow, they're on home. She's ult, she's ult. On a half. One. That's huge. Now we can go take this big right flank here. We're going to try and fall back a little bit because if this whole team looks at us, we're going to want to be able to get out. I'm going to roll back to the tree. Just didn't want to get picked up. <laughs> I'm doing that shit right now. They're DPS too. Holy shit. Just their whole team. I guess the Overwatch God said I needed a free one. This game is just a feast, yeah. Honestly, not a bad idea to avoid them all. Quiet on set is a uh wait was that was that Disney or Nickelodeon? Oh, I've never seen that. It's it's about this um it's about like these executives or it's like child actors like talking about their time on um like the shows like popular shows. Oh, the Disney. It, yeah, I don't know if it was Disney or Nickelodeon, but like it was. Oh wait, I think it was Nick. Wait. Yeah, it was Nick. There's like a story of like uh, a couple of like famous actors and actresses like spending nights over executives' houses and shit. Like, that's what kind of parent are you? Yeah. What yeah. parent are you if you allow that? I don't know. And Dan Schneider in the toes. Dan Schneider in the toes. Yeah. I always knew he was weird. Yeah, bro. It's just crazy. All right. I'm gonna try I'm gonna to here. Um. They have junk rat, by the way. Soldier in one, soldier in literally one, man. Oh, she's getting healed. Soldier in right side, we might be able to get her. Oh, she's throwing. I'll just go walk right, up man. behind her. Soldier in, soldier in, help our crew, help our crew, help our crew. Help our oh my right god, there. if I could hit a fucking shot, bro. I didn't what hit a single killing? shot. 
I would just like it to be known. Looking at Mercy. I'm not walking too close. Okay, don't push this room. Yeah, Try to back out. I'm walking out. Better back out. Put it down one. Put it down one. Just heal me. Heal me, man. Looking at Zen. Looking at Zen because he's kind of just sitting out there in the open. Nice. It's a waste of res. Just a free kill. I'm gonna walk up with him, try and get this last pick. Really secure it for us. There we go. Yeah, they're just dog shit. <laughs> yeah. Diamond has some of the most unbalanced games I've ever seen. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. GG, good job. GG, well played. That's crazy, bro. So just small hitbox, and my aim was just bad there. With both DPS and enemy team, yeah. <laughs> I was just inside of that, Ryan, bro. I feel bad that I was living. Let's see, plat one? Hey. Let's get this last dub and get placed in diamond. That would be sick. <laughs> Smack the fuck out of her real quick. Alright, we're going to peek out left side here. Trying to get an off angle from on them. No one's peeking our left side, so we're kind of chill over here right now. And kite back as we're just putting out damage on this Genji. Genji won. Genji still won. Looking Mercy. Mercy stuck. Where'd she go? Okay, no way we lost her, right? Where did the bitch go? Wait, how'd she get out? That's crazy. We got soldier off. There we go. The only reason we pushed that soldier there is because we had already hit that nade on him, which gives us the advent the advantage in that fight to make it to where it's good for us to still walk on him there. <laughs> We're seeing how secure jail port. How did she get out, bro? Oh shit. I accidentally right clicked her. I might have been able to kill her. Watch for Farah. I'm gonna pop out right side here, try and get a shot or two off on this Farah. Oh, I can just finish her here. I'm gonna hold this position here. No actual way. Wait, why would she ever go for that res? Oh, dude, I went to go grab health pack. That's so dumb of me. I should've just stayed there. Unlucky. Oh, my whole team's coming with me. And are we whatever. Okay, Lucio. These are all there because they're all already low and it's going to force them to where it's going to be really hard for them to get to like beef 
to try and walk out of position because they were so low and they knew they'd die. And then now we're just playing around main. Gonna try and look for this Genji so he can't get out. We don't hear Hog on us yet. There we go. Watch for Hook here. We're gonna play a little bit back until the Hog hooks. Now we can go in. Look for this Farah. Oh, no shot, guys. Huge sleep. Oh, we gotta just get out. She can't res that. We're chilling. Oh, thank God. I just need to get in and do some damage, bro. Genji headshot. He's one. Nice. Who got out? Wow, I hit the headshot there? That's crazy. He wasn't even looking at me. They're on ball. It's honestly fine by me. I can play more aggressive now because they're on ball. I have less chance of getting just hooked and rolled. Oh, carry your cast. Nice. Looking at Lucio. Lucio won. Oh no, I didn't get healed, damn. They still win that though. I mean, Shard, I kind of forget like the SR I'm playing in sometimes. Like I'm just used to playing in GM players. And with a ca cast sitting there, even if I'm sitting that far back, no Mercy would ever go for that. But because they're not necessarily using their brain, you know, that's why they went for that. Still a misplay on my part for not standing there and watching it even harder. Unlucky. Then we just try to get out. Oh, we killed this far out here. Genji's half right now. Oh, damn it. I should have rolled out, not harder in. Look at a Mercy, look at Mercy. Dude, my team's popping off too this game. Pasta with mushrooms? What kind of protein are you tossing in your pasta? Alright, then here we're playing top left so we can really just keep poking them as they walk in. Don't want to make it easy for them to walk in. Oh shoot, we can't help you here. We want to go in a bit, try and help our queen out as much as we can. Ninja's one. Oh, she's just... Oh, dude, someone like had her by a rope. She's... Okay, we gotta focus up. Try and get these picks that are coming back out from spawn. GG, well played guys. Wonder Shard. Like if I won the next game, if it would have wind streak modifier. I don't see why it wouldn't. Sweet, sweet victory. Like where did the mercy go after that? She had to run out. 
Predicted rank still plat one? Oh, dude, so close to diamond. Dang. Dang, I'm surprised it didn't put us in diamond. Oh well, though. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far in the video, consider dropping a like and a sub. It really does help me out. And if I can make this a full-time job, I'll be getting even more videos out for you guys just like this unranked to GM. And one last thing before I go, I stream every Monday through Thursday about 4 p.m. Central to about midnight. I'll also be finishing this unranked to GM Wednesday and Thursday of this week after this video gets posted the next few days. Come check me out.